Let's get uh, six balls on the baseline. And then, are you with the guards again? Played at, uh, originally started at Wilberforce University. Played there my freshman year. After my freshman year, I transferred to Cedarville University. I finished my career there under Pat Estep. Uh, played well. I uh, was never an all-conference guy or anything like that. Was more of a utility guy. Um, Coach Estep credits me for help changing the culture of Cedarville University, so I think that's where I had, uh, hang my hat on a little bit. What were you thinking of as a career? after your playing days were over while you were in college? No, that's a great question. I had no interest at all at being a coach. Um, I was an accounting undergrad. Um, it's kind of how my mind worked. I was a math guy, numbers guy. Uh, coach Estep seen something in me early on and said, hey man, I think you can be a great coach one day. Um, and, and actually offered me an assistant coaching spot right after college. So I volunteered as an assistant coach there. Um, but I had no interest at all at being a coach. Um, and he seen something in me and kind of sparked my interest a little bit. And then that year on, um, I, I was able to coach there, got in touch with Coach Jacobs at Baylor University, was a graduate assistant there for two years, and then uh, was stuck with him ever since. Um, I, at Baylor, I, I got my MBA, my Master's of Business Administration, one of the only GAs for the men's basketball team to get his MBA. Um, my thought process was, um, again, was an accounting undergrad, it's kind of how I work, kind of how I operated. And if I was going to go to school, I want to get something that's going to push me further my career long term outside of basketball. So I got my MBA, Master of Business Administration. Ice, ice, ice! Pull, pull, hang! Get him over here. You see the hang dribble? Let it hang in that hand. That gets the reject. Here we go. Good, pound cross, pound cross, real tight, pound, pound tweed! You are the player development guy on Coach Jacobs' staff. How is that different from, I don't want to say just being an assistant coach in quotes, but how is it different? It's different because I think you have a more relational aspect with the players. Um, you're with them on the day-to-day -day aspect of grinding, getting on the court, um, looking at the different features of their game. Uh, whereas an assistant coach, you're more looking holistically, whereas a director of player development, you're individually based. Okay, how can that player get better? What are their strengths and weaknesses? Nice, right, good pace, Kale! Good pace, Kale! Ice it, ice it, ice it! Good, rebound! Good! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Um, what footwork do you get to? What do they need to work on in a day in and day out to become an overall better player? Um, I think it's just more individual based, more relational, one on one, um, where you're looking at um, how, can, how can that player grow, um, both on the floor and off the floor, where you want to get a relationship with them. Um, so it's just a little different in that aspect where you're more individual. How can that individual player get better? You had a rehearsal. That was me. Stop it. So my history with Coach Jacobs, I know what he wants in players, especially as a guard, or pretty much all players, but I know what he's looking for. So to be an extension of him and work on them on the court, um, on those individual things, um, to help them on the court when in practice settings, um, that way they can be a better player. White, white, white. Good, that's it, Bob. Great rep, great rep, great rep. Good! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Great rep, KG! Oh, challenge, I would probably say the biggest challenge would just be influencing and installing Coach Jagas' philosophy. A little bit more freedom, um, a little bit more um, reading and reacting. It's a clean slate, so I think the, the fact that they are new, um, they are fresh and hungry and willing to learn. Um, they don't have a previous mindset, they're open-minded, so everything that we're saying, they're, they're taking with open arms and trying to install right away. Fight through, fight through, fight through, fight through, fight through! I'm here, I'm here!